You must be one of the new settlers. Welcome to Gilded Vale. You'll be pleased to know that we've had some recent vacancies here. Of course, we'll need to make some inquiries first. The inestimable Lord Radric VII has taken great pains to insulate our town from Widewind's legacy. Have you ever sired a hollow-born child? The well-being of this village is my business. You'd best get used to the idea if you intend to live among us. I should warn you, stranger. Here in Gilded Vale, we have a special place for dissidents, charlatans, and those who would hide a curse in our midst. His lordship's wife is with child and do any day now. Without his approval, I shan't be able to find you a permanent settlement. It will have to wait until after the birth. We can continue our interview then, after the bell tolls from Radric's hold to signal my lord's new heir. In the meantime, you can find temporary accommodations at the inn, just southwest of here. Whatever your problem, it sounds like a matter for an animancer. However, the only animancer in Gilded Vale isn't in any condition to speak. Consider yourself fortunate. After she failed Lord Radric, we saw to it that she wouldn't profit from the misplaced trust of others. A bad cure is often worse than none at all. But if you're set on finding a bottle of troll piss or a... Keep out of... 
Listen. Two tolls. Let that be the last. Three. Gods have mercy. It seems your arrival is ill-timed. Three bells toll only for the death of a Radric. Fear Lord Radric's heir is lost, or else Hollowborn, and so lost all the same. You should tread carefully. Circumstances have changed a great deal. Looking for someone in that tree? Uh, I could introduce you. I meant no offense. Let's put this matter to rest over around, shall we? My treat. Hoping to soothe our pride with a few Adira coppers, eh? We don't need your coin. Go on, say it again. I'm itching for an excuse. Fine, you're itching for the kindling touch of your sister, you cocksfeather! I'll cut that barrel looking tongue out of your head! This is a misunderstanding. I didn't say whatever it is you think I said. We've nigh quarreled.
That's where you're wrong. Not quite how I hope to get to know the neighbors. Thank you for your timely assistance with that awkward situation. Courtesy is a rare pleasure in these parts, though your accent suggests that you are no more local than I. I suppose introductions are in order after that little fiasco. Alof Corvisor, at your service. Well, I'm a wizard by training, and an adventurer by necessity. I was born in the Seathwood, part of the mainland of the Adir Empire. And both of my parents served the nobility, which afforded me an education for which I am grateful. However, there were no open positions in those houses, and... And how exactly did you come to be here? In Griffin Ruins? Well, those can be dangerous places during the best of times, which these are not. Yet half the locals would arrest you for trespassing, and the rest would kill you outright. I'm curious. What exactly did you find there? And you survived? I've heard such a thing was impossible. But it seems you either have a knack for timing or the favor of the gods. As should I, given recent events. It's just as well. I've had enough of the watered wine and lumpy beds at the inn. They say even the owner tired of the place. Just up and left one day. It explains quite a lot about the upkeep. Perhaps I could join you. I could use a change of scenery, and I find it's better to travel in numbers. Excellent. I shall follow you. I'm here. Hello. Thank you. 
Good day to you. Thank you. 